So I recently published a YouTube video on growing this mango tree in my backyard here in Modesto, California, Zone 9B. I got a lot of questions about it. People are just surprised that you can grow and fruit mangoes in Northern California. But as you can see, the location is very important. Uh, your microclimates in your backyard is very important when uh, planting a frost tender tree such as this manila mango I have growing in the San Joaquin Valley of California. But some of the other questions folks have is what kind of fertilizer I use when growing mangoes in our marginal climate. Hi, my name is Jeff, the Tropical Garden Guy. Today we're going to talk about the fertilizer I use on Manila Mango. But first, if you like this channel, make sure to hit that like, subscribe button, the notification bell. Comments and questions, leave them in the comment section below. I do my best to get back to everybody with their comments and their questions. So let's take a look at the treat and the fertilizer I use. So the mango tree that I have growing here in my backyard in zone 9B is very healthy. It has never gotten any, um, it's never gotten any anthracnose, which is very common in when you're growing uh, tropical trees in marginal climates that have cool winters, uh, cool wet winters that we have here. And so it's important to get the most amount of growth out of your tree before the winter hits. You want it to go get be very healthy. The tree has to be very healthy. A weak tree will be more subject to uh, cold than uh, a, a healthy tree. Uh, here in Modesto, California, I use a certain kind of fertilizer that uh, both it raises the soil pH and also provides nutrition for the tree. And as you can see this tree, I don't know if you can see way up there, but it's in a growth flush. Oh yeah, there you go, right up there. It's in a growth flush. Um, I just harvested almost all the fruit. I think I have one or two left that haven't quite greened up, but you guys are more interested in the fertilizer that I use. So let's take a look at the fertilizer. Um, let's see if we can get this in here there we go as you can see this fertilizer is this by the way this fertilizer is organic and i use it for other trees in my garden but as you can see there's little bits of uh sulfur in there and our soil ph here in the san joaquin valley at least where i'm at tends to run quite alkaline as as it does uh our water and mangoes like a ph between 5.5 and 6.5. Well, our soil temperature, or excuse me, the soil pH here is closer to eight, which is definitely not good. You plant a, a, a mango tree here and the thing will generally just sulk. It'll sit there and it just doesn't grow. Well, this fertilizer I use, um, has, like I said, it showed has a uh, it's organic and it has sulfur in it and that sulfur helps raise the soil pH. Helps the tree take up the nutrients um, and grows really good. Uh, I got about 20 fruit off this tree. It's the first year. And uh, as I mentioned, it's growing in the side yard of my backyard, the side part where our houses are about 10 feet apart. But so the question is, what is the fertilizer I use? Well, I've discussed this before. I use this fertilizer for a lot of my trees and it's this one, Polytone. Now, I found this in a huge bag. Take a look over here. I found this in a huge bag on sale, free delivery. And I'll tell you where I got that in a moment, but um, the fertilizer is, not, is a slow release fertilizer. It has mycorrhizae in it. Um, it's just really a good fertilizer all around. It's not one to jump into fast growth, but it slowly but surely, it slowly but surely uh, fertilizes the soil. And that's what I think you need uh, for mangoes, at least here in my Modesto, California zone 9B garden. 
um, it's meant for or, uh, evergreens and it just does so good. It does good on my guavas, it does good on my lychees and longons, but uh, yeah, these are the, the last mangoes that I harvested from my tree. And let me show you this, look at this. I paid like $14 for this eight pound bag of Holly Tone organic fertilizer. And take a look at this giant thing. This bag of Espoma Holly Tone evergreen fertilizer, and it's organic, 27 pounds. I got this for, get this, like 15, $16 on, on uh, Home Depot's website. So, and that was delivered, free delivery. Can you imagine a big bag like this? So anybody interested, I'm not <laughs> being supported in any way, shape or form by uh, Home Depot, but I just wanted to let my viewers know this big old bag. I paid that almost for this small bag and you can get this Holly Tone at Home Depot. And it's the, it, it, perfect for my mango in my backyard here in Modesto, California. So that's it. I use that Holly Tone fertilizer twice a year, about a cup spread around the base of the tree, out right about to the drip line. My name is Jeff. If you like this channel, the Tropical Garden Guy channel, hit that like, subscribe button, notification bell, comments and questions, leave them in the comment section below. I do my best to get back to everybody with their comments and questions. You have a wonderful day.